Organisers of a massive rave party being held in Hampshire breathed a huge sigh of relief this afternoon when permission for this record-breaking event was finally granted. With just hours to go before the start of the Popham rave, a licence still hadn't been granted by the local authority. But now 20,000 young people are starting to arrive at Popham Airfield, where circus tents are tonight providing the biggest party ever held under canvas. Max Prangnell reports. Despite some last-minute arguments over the siting of toilets, Basingstoke and Dean District Council relented this afternoon and awarded the entertainment's licence to the organisers of the rave. There has been three days of negotiation to get the go-ahead for the party at the Popham Airfield site. The promoters were delighted. Actually, at last, we've got the licence, and here it is. So, uh, thank God for that. A lot of hard work and a lot of sleepless nights. And even this morning, we were still hard at it, and they gave us a licence a few minutes ago. The promoters say they've gone out of their way to find a site which will cause the least disturbance to local residents. Situated well away from any densely populated areas, and in a shallow valley surrounded by trees, the noise from the big tops is unlikely to cause any serious problems. For £22, the ravers get three different types of music, a fun fair, a cinema, and of course, a relaxation area. In fact, the only difference between what's going on here and what's happening at any other amusement park this bank holiday is that this runs all night and doesn't finish until 7 o'clock on Sunday morning. These 20,000 people that are coming here are, um, you know, your average bank clerk, the girl behind the Sainsbury's counter, they're, they're our sons and daughters, quite normal people, and they're coming to have a bit of musical Disneyland for uh, right through the night and a bit of fun. It's just as well Monday is a bank holiday, 20,000 youngsters might need that time to recover.